Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. We got a small submission back from CGC this week, and I think it's those Spider Man books that we're looking for. So uh, let's go ahead and take a look. All right, let's go ahead and get in this box here. Um, I know we picked up a collection maybe a couple months ago, two or three months ago, uh, some earlier Spider Man books. And we did, uh, did a little video. Uh, the books were kind of in that two to three range. Um, I think with a little bit of, a little dry cleaning and a, and a press, should get close to three. Man, I'm shooting for a two. If we can get a two, I'm happy, so. But anything higher than that, that's A plus. So with that said, let's go ahead and pull out this first book. All right, this one is Amazing Spider-Man, number 19. Try to get that glare, there you go. Um, as you can tell, it's a white cover, so it's really dirty. Um, let's see, anything significant? Just a human torch and Sandman enforcers there. Appearance, but let's see what we got. Ooh, 4.0. Heck yeah. Man, that, that'll work. These books, when they came in, they, they needed a lot of help. I can tell you that. I was debating whether I should send them in or not, just... But uh, man, that's, and if you're looking for a low grade uh, early Spider-Man, that is nice. 4.0, wow, we're on a good start. Heck yeah, that's cool. Let's see. I didn't send them all in, I just kind of sent in a handful um, just to kind of see what we were gonna get there. But now I'm kind of wondering, let's see, this is Amazing Spider-Man number 21. This is another human torch and, and a beetle appearance. And let's see what we got here. 3.5, heck yeah. Man, they turned out pretty nice. I mean, right here you can tell there's a lot of uh, spine wear. I mean, it just breaks the color, but wow, they clean, they... Mm. Yeah, I'll take that. That's pretty cool. Heck yeah. Okay, here's another one, let's see. This one is Amazing Spider-Man number 22. I think it's the first appearance of uh, Princess Python. And we'll see, 4.5, wow. I was not expecting mid-grades on these guys, but 4.5. Yeah, see there's crease there that breaks the color. That's at least three, three inches there. But other than that, this, uh, this book looks really good. Yeah. Cool. Heck yeah, I'll take that. All right, so we've got Amazing Spider-Man 23, and I think this is one of, uh, oh, third appearance of Green Goblin. There you go. That's cool. Try to get that glare off there, guys. See what we got here? 3.5. Wow. Yeah, this one was, man, there's a lot of tanning around the edges, a lot of creases that break the color here, but I mean, it just, it's just, it's just a cool cover. I mean, that is nice. Wow, 3.5. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm satisfied, yes. Um, the labels are the right labels. I'm, I'm making sure of that, because I don't know if you've seen the last video, we had a uh, submission come back and the labels were uh, misplaced. <laughs> that, well, they were switched, so on two books. But we did get those sent back in, so hopefully they'll 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 be they'll have the right labels this time. So, but anyway, Amazing Spider-Man 34, um, just a craven appearance, just a classic cover there. And see what we got. 4.0, heck yeah! Wow, that is cool. I like it. Man, you can't you can't beat that. Okay, so this is Amazing Spider-Man 38. Let's see if there's anything. Second cameo appearance of Mary Jane. There we go. Let's see what we got on that one. Ooh, a 5.0, woo! Wow, that's cool. 5.0, I'll take that. Man, it's really nice. Yeah, that turned out really good, so. Let's see if we can get that glare off of there. There we go, 5.0. Wow, that's cool. All right, on to the, I think this is the last of the Spider-Man books here. This one is uh, Amazing Spider-Man number 45. 
You can see that uh, that yellow cover there. Uh, third appearance of uh, Lizard. Pretty cool. See what we got here. Ooh, 4.5. Wow. That is cool. Man, these these grades, these these books came out really nice. I'm impressed. That's that's cool. Well, I guess we're definitely going to send in the other ones, other Spider-Man books. So, but there's one one more book. Um, it wasn't the uh, Spider-Man book. It was a book I wanted to send in. Just a classic cover here, Tales to Astonish number ninety-three. That's a that is a Hulk versus Silver Surfer. It bears really nice. I mean, I just love that cover. It's iconic. And let's see what we got here. 5.0. Wow, that's cool. That cleaned up pretty nice, too. I mean, it was a lot of wear on the edges. and But uh, a little staining at the corners here on the back. But other than that, it it presents very well. That's, look at that. Let me get that glare off of it. There you go. That's really cool. Wow. Yeah, that's, that's a nice book. Well, heck yeah. Make sure that's it. Yeah, that is it. Well, we got some good grades here. Um, I was impressed with the Spider-Man books. Um, like I said, it's hoping to get, you know, two to three, but uh, I don't think we even got a three. We got a three, five, and up. So, um, yeah, I'm happy. So, that's really cool. So, I guess we'll go ahead and send in the other um, group of uh, Spider-Man books, and um, hopefully we'll get those back, the same grades. But, but yeah, overall, it was really cool. So, but, uh, well, guys, we appreciate y'all uh, checking out this video, and uh, thank you for supporting local. And uh, until then, hey, y'all take it easy. Be careful, and uh, we'll see you.